Thanks for speaking to us. So how are you preparing for this big bout? Same as usual, really. Um, it's a big fight, um, big occasion. I come in the end of the dog. Um, I mean, it's supposed to come with the lion's den together, what I want. Yeah. So what do you make of the gender as an opponent? You've called him an amateur, is what I read somewhere. Well, you know, I don't mean anything disrespectful when I say that. He spent a lot of years as an amateur uh, and he did you know, well. He's you know, medals at various levels and it's very good, but this is a professional game now. Uh, you know, he got opponents which haven't been at you know, my level, but still, I'm not you know, looking at that. Like he's inexperienced or anything. Uh, It'll just be good to see where he's gone. Sure. Is there, um, tell me a little bit about how you prepare for a bout like this. I mean, is there anything special that you do? How many hours do you usually practice or train or work out? Yeah, we've had a 12 week camp. So, it's obviously started off um, in not so strenuous. And we've built up as time goes on. Uh, but it will be training every day. Um, possibly have the odd day off now and again. Uh, and it'll be two feet times a day, but we've really done tactics for the agenda, so um, I got the experience if it doesn't work, I'll go to plan B and do something else. And how do you like being in India? Is this your first time No, I was here for the press conference back uh, a few weeks ago. Uh, I mean, I'd be too fairly nice, it's, it's been great. The, the general people, the most respectful people I've possibly come across, and I've travelled quite a few places over the world. I know we have the food, the food probably the best as well. Yeah. Thank you so much. All the best for the bout on Saturday. Thank you for speaking to us. Yeah, thank you.